So how's it going? Yeah. <laughs> You're like <laughs> It's true. Don't hide it. It's okay. It's exhausting actually. Like we just made half an hour but normal way up. Yeah but you're running. I'm scared not runner. <laughs> it's not good. <sighs> How about I would say it's beautiful way definitely. Yes. But it's okay to take some time. You don't need to run. So generally we will go I think pace like half an hour go, five minutes break, half an hour go, five minutes break. Yeah. Banana break time. Nice. It's natural energy. Police would never admit. But I see that she's a little bit struggling. What? Yeah. Huh? So you can hear how the water is blowing underneath the stones. Kind of interesting. This is the glacier. I forgot the name, but beautiful. Now we're going up this ridge. Amazing view. We passed the first peak, Svelnose, and now we are making our way to the second one. And then we are already on the way to Galtopin. It's an amazing view. So, another little break. Every half an hour, we Stop for a little moment. How do you like it? Every 100 meters up, it's more and more exciting, and the view is just amazing. People are stupid and smart at the same time. <laughs> They're sliding down the hill. <laughs> Might do it later. <laughs> we are almost at the top. There's also the trouble made it. We made it almost. See you on the top. Life on the way to the peak. Okay, actually we were drinking a coffee in this hut before, <laughs> but now we're on the way to the peak. Whoops. And, 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 and. And touch highest king mountain in Scandinavia. We are oh, from here. So yeah, we could make it faster, but it was completely fine. I really enjoy. Ah, it's nice. You should definitely visit this hut and have hot coffee, solo super, <laughs> some chocolate and stuff. Nice, nice tour. Look at this view. Oh. 
after a nice meal we're making our way back down hopefully a little bit faster than this four and a half hours which we needed to get up i will claim that we're fast and say let's say three and a half hours so here a little disclaimer I'm an experienced person in the mountains and the choices that you make up there, you make for yourself. Glissading is dangerous and should only be attempted if you know what you're doing and if you accept the consequences. In best case, you have at least something to break, like a pickaxe or a wooden stick. Don't try this yourself. As everyone knows, this is fucking dangerous, guys. Don't do this. So yesterday we didn't film because we wanted to have a day off and we were going swimming and stuff. Just to have a show actually. <laughs> but it was nice we had sauna. Uh, and today we are making our last couple meters to Oslo. It's approximately one more hour. And it's raining again. And I'm so tired of this one. I'm so goddamn tired. It was raining very hard last night. The tent is holding it. Very good tent. If you're looking for a lightweight, very good tent, this is the one to go for. Not these fucking MSRs. But I will make another video on this. So, stay tuned. We're packing our stuff now and then we're heading our way to Oslo. The weather around the noon should be better there, so let's hope for the best. So we are in Oslo. Woo, we just had a nice coffee. Yeah, but before we were driving uh, like 45 minutes to Oslo and the rain. Yes, it was rainy as so hell. I got wet again, my pullover is wet. Ah yeah, also we packed all our stuff when it was like rain, cats and dogs. So everything is wet. It was a hard time finding a parking lot as always in big cities, especially in Oslo, at least from my experience. When also I was in the rain. Yes. We were driving through the most strangest area ever. Oh, nice camera. Um, the strangest area ever with a lot of junkies there sitting there in front of a house. But we're here in Oslo. Oslo yes. And uh, yeah, I said we had a nice coffee and now we will walk a little bit through the city and um, yeah, let's see what's happening. So Pulix mm -hmm. gets finally a burger she was craving for. but we can't I only see myself hello found very nice plant shop looks amazing inside I wish it would be my home <laughs> what do you want to say on the last day in Norway good decision to go to mountains and generally we were very lucky with the weather I would say even though it was raining so Norway showed us how 
serve it can be at the same time Norway also showed us sunny weather how to swim in fjords and how to camping without rain and it's amazing <laughs> yeah so yeah in general I'm also have very nice feelings for Norway and still love this country yeah it was nice so we're packing our stuff now and driving our last three and a half hours to Kristiansand to take the ferry then in the middle of a day yes Oleg's not so happy. <laughs> yeah, we have to stop and fix motorcycle before we will continue our our way through Denmark. Yeah, we already so we arrived in Denmark. Yeah. Firstly. Update, we are in Denmark. <laughs> <laughs> we were in Denmark, yes. So we're in Denmark and can you lift this? Yes. So we're in Denmark and the motorcycle is making problems since a while, like make strange vibrations. And at least the chain, like it's normal that it's lengthening a little bit, so we have to tension it. That's what we are going to do now. <laughs> I needed to touch the chain a little bit. Oh, ah, okay. Like now we're on a long run now. So you okay? We are fine. Thank Thank you. Don't need help. Thanks. That's one of the nicest thing of riding a motorcycle. Everyone is just working together. Everyone is helping each other. Like no matter what, you would stop and would ask at least, hey, can I help you somehow? When some when you see that someone is at the road working and trying to some, do something with tools and stuff. So, hello. Hello. This is the end of the video and also the end of the series of our trip through Norway with the no a motorcycle. And uh, yeah, we just wanted to say thank you for all the subscribers which came by and supporters, all the likes, comments you leave at our videos and um, there's more to come in the future. So I hope you stay tuned. Um, thank you, very appreciate you that you were watching our videos. And Fabi just finished to work on this fifth episode, but there will be more. So stay tuned for the future.